might be in your lane some. I think it's kind of dancey though. Welcome back to Reaction Extraction. I'm Ty and this is Dad. And today mm -hmm. we are going to be doing Happy Mondays. Step on. Happy Mondays. I believe this is an early 90s song. Maybe even 1990. And I know Happy Mondays. UK band that um, had some pretty interesting music. Uh, I was pretty young when they were around. Um, they're part of a, I don't know, a scene that was transitioning from 80s pop into not only alternative stuff, but kind of a dancey, trippy sound, I think. Okay. Which, you know, I mean, you guys out there that experienced the early 90s, what a music scene that was very diverse. And Happy Mondays were part of it, so happy to, happy, huh? Happy to have him on the show. Let's check it out, man. Let's do it. Let's see what you think about this.
have to go first on this one. All right, very interesting tune. I like a lot of things that's going on in there. Um, I wasn't too. I was trying. The only thing I couldn't really latch onto were the vocals. Okay. Um, just weren't gravitating to me. All right. Um, but yeah, I could definitely hear like some, um, like this being in a soundtrack for Night at the Roxbury, and but I also hear like a lot of like hip hop influences, especially totally. uh, on the on the back back end. Yeah, you really do. Um, yeah, I mean, it, I like the aesthetics of the video as well. Like, it just it seems like it's like low budget, you know, like just not caring. I'm um, not trying too hard, and I like that a lot. You know, it seems mm-hmm. like a lot of things that <clears throat> are used in present day videos from smaller artists. Okay. And then, you know, it's just Understand. something I'm used to, and so I, I kind of gravitate to that. Ah, so there were familiar elements in there for you. Mm hmm. Um, is this Brit pop? I don't know. This kind of has some Stone Roses, Blur, Strip Back, Fun, Funky, Stone Roses, especially. Fool's Gold, Fool's Gold, that's what this reminds me of. It's, I don't know if it's Britpop or not, let us know. It definitely has an early 90s vibe to it with those kind of elements. Now this sounds dated, but the time period was very much like this. No, yeah, yeah. You know, the 80s sound is gone, mm-hmm. and this is... Uh, it's the drums, it's the new... It's the um, the new sampling techniques and it's those yeah. keyboards and the and the background vocals with, from the the female singers mm-hmm. coming in. That's very '90s as well and yeah, kind of bluesy too. Mm-hmm. I like that. Okay, so foundationally, what you listen to today, this is like the roots. You can definitely tell the difference between an electronic synth pop song and this direction and the way they're going. Yeah, it's definitely they're they're kind of in their own lane here, and I think uh, with the, those elements of the keyboards mixed in with those drum patterns, um, you know, you're getting a t- different type of vibe. Kind of know. funkier than like electronic music was or is, mm-hmm. right? Maybe the deeper drives, the harder beats, mm-hmm. and this is kind of dreamy. Yeah, dreamy is a good word, and I like Chill 80, music? 80s pop is more like synth. You know what I mean? These are like exactly. keyboards. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, I see. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm glad we did Happy Mondays because it really defines that transition really well. Mm-hmm. Totally. So, did you like? Yeah, it was good. I, I, I like it too. All right. Two thumbs up. Well, thanks for checking this reaction shot. Thanks for checking this reaction instruction out with us, guys. Um, this was Happy Mondays, um, Step On, and uh, yeah. It's kind of hard not to like that. Yeah, I mean, it's just enjoyable. Well said. All right. Well, um, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Thank you so much. Bye.